In Psalms 27, verse 1, it says, The Lord is my light and my salvation. We understand salvation, but usually we don't understand God's light. It is uh, often talked about as the light in the heart. Uh, that is the heart of the mind. The light is like going into a dark room, not being able to even feel your way, not being able to see anything, and all of a sudden you throw the switch and everything becomes clear. It's that way every day in God's world. How glorious is the sunrise. You welcome every brand new day as the sky grows brighter with life-giving rays of light coming over the horizon. And if you've ever seen a glorious sunrise, you're in awe of what is happening around you. Well, the same can happen inside of you. The light of God dispels the darkness of doubt. It will dispel the darkness of fear. And you know, sometimes as a human being, we get gripped in fear. Well, fear is like a darkness. It's a, a, a complete absence of knowing what to do. And then we get gripped in the worst, which is anxiety. The power of God can turn on the light, and the minute the light is turned on, even a grain of mustard seed light, a little bit of light, it will dispel doubt, fear, and anxiety. Troubles melt away under the light of God. I've had this happen. It is like it is an aha experience where before you didn't have a clue and all of a sudden everything becomes clear and you just know your soul is uplifted. The soul can be in darkness. It can be in a, a wasteland of not knowing what is on the horizon and then the light of God comes, and it is something that brings calm in the beginning, a relaxation, a tranquility, and then an abiding joy. All the cells of your body can be filled with light. And there's an absence of light, there is disease, there is uh, a, a sickness in the body. But the light of God can be turned on within a single cell, within a single thought, within a single organ of the body. And it will be filled with light, God's light, and God's healing. Your mind is enlightened with wonderful ideas. Now, enlightenment is a turning on of the light, but it means more than that. It's, it's a wisdom that comes not from you, but as the Bible says, the wisdom from above. That doesn't mean that God is way, way up there somewhere. It just means that we're not closed in our mind anymore that we open, that we expand it, that we receive. And actually in the Bible where it talks about heaven, the original word meant expansion. Expansion of what? Expansion of your mind. Expansion where you're not closed in on yourself, where you're receiving the light of God, the enlightenment of God. And new ideas pour forth. The, the vision, the, the opportunity thoughts that come into your mind. Instead of thinking, well, this is the way it's always going to be. I just have to accept it. You get excited again about what is coming. You are literally, how do I say this, in tiptoe 
absolute expectancy for the good that the day will bring. You're just standing up tall. You're, you're waiting. You're reaching out in anticipation. And your world takes on a new look in transforming the light of love. You're no longer in the darkness of, of being loveless. You are infilled with the light of God, which is love. And you go forth your day ready, empowered, to overcome any obstacle that may come. You live in a victorious way, for the light of the Christ Spirit is constantly within you.